Hey there fellow investors, welcome back to EV Equity Edge. Today, we're here to dissect the latest insights, trends, and news surrounding Mullen Automotive stock. If you find our content valuable, hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and ring the notification bell. Stay up to date with our daily analysis on Mullen and other exciting electric vehicle stocks. We appreciate your engagement. Comment below with your questions, thoughts, or suggestions. Let's get started. Mullen started the day with an open price of 15.84 cents, and as the trading session progressed, it closed slightly lower at 15.66 cents. However, it's important to note that the stock showed a positive daily change of 10.67%. Now, let's take a closer look at the daily high and low. Mullen reached a peak of 15.88 cents, showcasing some upward momentum. On the other hand, the stock touched a low of 14.10 cents during the day, indicating a potential level of support. The range for the day was 12.58%, reflecting the volatility in Mullen's price movement. Such fluctuations present both opportunities and challenges for investors, as they navigate the ever-changing market landscape. When it comes to volume, Mullen saw an average volume of 185.31 million shares, but today's trading session stood out with a daily volume of 401.56 million shares. The increased volume suggests heightened market activity and investor interest in the stock. Now, let's discuss how today's price action interacted with the points of resistance and support we mentioned yesterday. The resistance levels we identified were at 20.02 cents, 21.85 cents, and 23.08 cents. Today, Mullen didn't reach those resistance levels, indicating that the stock still faces challenges in surpassing those barriers. On the support side, we had levels at 13.90 cents, 13.67 cents, and 11.01 .01 cents. Today, Mullen's price action showed some interaction with the support levels, as the stock touched a low of 14.10 cents, which aligns closely with the lower support levels. Overall, today's price action for Mullen showcased positive momentum with a notable increase in price and higher volume. While the stock didn't reach the resistance levels, it found some support around the levels we discussed. Today, we have an interesting article titled, The Fate of Mullen Stock Remains Up in the Air. Let's summarize and analyze the key points. Just a couple of months ago, Mullen Automotive found itself in a precarious situation. With its stock price sinking to $0.06 cents per share, the company was at risk of being delisted by the Nasdaq. In a last-ditch effort, Mullen executed a 1-for-25 reverse share split to boost the share price above the Nasdaq's threshold and avoid delisting. However, the relief was short-lived as Mullen's stock price continued to decline steadily, reaching $0.10 cents per share by July 3. Investors witnessed a staggering 93% decrease in their stock's value post-reverse split. But then, a glimmer of hope appeared. On July 5, Mullen announced that it had hired two law firms to investigate illegal naked short selling of its common stock. This move aimed to uncover any market manipulation and hold accountable those involved in shady dealings. The following day, Mullen further announced a $25 million stock buyback plan, utilizing its own cash reserves. This strategy aimed to potentially squeeze the wrongdoers and create a short squeeze, thereby driving up the stock's price. Investors reacted positively to these announcements, and within two days, Mullen's stock price more than doubled to $0.22 cents per share. Although the stock has retraced some gains since then, it still retains a 60% increase over its pre-lawyer and buyback announcement value. Recently, Mullen unveiled its latest invention, the PowerUp Mobile EV Charging Truck. This innovative vehicle offers roadside assistance to stranded EV motorists, providing DC fast charge and level 2 charging capabilities. While the PowerUp truck is available for immediate sale on an advance order basis, Mullen's hope is to generate more sales, especially since its other EVs have had a slow start. To put things into perspective, Mullen's recent press release highlighting the sale of 22 EV cargo vans to a single customer for $14,000 each resulted in $308,000 in revenue. This marks Mullen's first recorded revenue, albeit modest, and translates to a price-to-sales ratio valuation of 314. The developments at Mullen, from the legal investigations to the stock buyback plan and the introduction of the PowerUp mobile EV charging truck, have generated investor interest and contributed to the stock's recent price movements. Now, let's keep a close eye on how these initiatives unfold and whether they lead to a positive turnaround for Mullen Automotive. Now, let's shift our focus to the future and analyze how Mullen Automotive, ticker symbol MULN, might interact with the levels of support and resistance in the next trading day. Starting with the resistance levels, we have 16.28 cents, 18.42 cents, and 19.55 cents. These levels can act as potential barriers, limiting the upward movement of the stock. If MULN manages to break through the first resistance at 16.28 cents, it could signal a potential bullish momentum. However, it might face a stronger challenge at the 18.42 cents level. Should the stock surpass this hurdle, it may encounter further resistance near 19.55 cents. On the other side, we have the support levels to keep an eye on. 
These levels, at 13.01 cents, 11.88 cents, and 9.74 cents, can act as potential floors, providing a cushion for the stock's downward movement. If MULN experiences a pullback, the first support level at 13.01 cents could come into play. A break below that level may increase the likelihood of testing the 11.88 cents support. And in the event of significant selling pressure, the stock could find support near 9.74 cents. As the stock approaches these key levels, it's essential to closely monitor the trading volume and market sentiment. High volume, coupled with positive news or market sentiment, could potentially provide the catalyst needed for MULN to break through resistance. Conversely, if there is high selling pressure or negative news, the stock may be more likely to test support levels. Remember, predicting precise price movements in the stock market is challenging, and unforeseen events can influence stock prices. It's crucial to conduct thorough research, stay updated on relevant news and market developments, and exercise caution when making investment decisions. With that said, keep an eye on Mullen Automotive as it interacts with these levels of support and resistance in the next trading day. The market's response to these price levels will provide valuable insights into the stock's short-term direction. If you found our insights valuable, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button to stay connected with our future analysis. But that's not all, we have an entire library of engaging content waiting for you. Make sure to check out our other videos where we delve into the captivating realm of EV stocks like Lucid, Rivian, Tesla, and NEO. You don't want to miss out on the latest developments and trends in this dynamic industry. Remember, your support through likes, subscriptions, and comments truly fuels our motivation to keep bringing you the most informative and engaging content. We appreciate each and every one of you. Keep investing, keep exploring, and keep pushing the boundaries of the EV world. Thank you for being a part of EV Equity Edge.